Uh, good day, students. Welcome to the captivating world of English class, literature, and language. This is Ms. Lina Oud, and this is English Grade 10. Over the next few minutes, we'll embark on a journey to uncover what you can anticipate from high school in class grade 10, from classic literature to honing your writing skills. Let's dive into the enriching experience that awaits you. So the main question that is to be covered in this video, why do we need to learn English? We have so many skills that are to be covered, the first and the so many strands. The first one is the power of literature. In your English class, you'll explore a diverse range of literary works, novels, plays, poems, each brimming with unique perspectives, emotions, and ideas. You'll learn to analyze and interpret texts. You'll discover hidden meanings and understanding the historical and cultural contexts that shape them. You will build critical thinking. Prepare to sharpen your critical thinking skills. English classes encourage you to question, evaluate, and form your own opinions about characters, themes, and plot developments. Through discussions and essays, you will learn how to express your thoughts coherently and persuasively. As it is English, communication is highly effective. English class is not just about reading, it's about communication. You will develop strong verbal and written skills that transcend the classroom. You will engage in debates, presentations, and you will craft well-structured essays that will empower you to express your ideas effectively in any context. You will explore the language and style used in either literature or to use in your writing. Get ready to delve into the intricacies of language and style. You'll uncover the power of world choice, sentence structure, and figurative language. You will have to analyze how authors manipulate, and you'll learn how to language and it will deepen your appreciation of the art of communication. You'll express creatively as creativity takes center stage in your English class. Through creative writing assi assignments, you'll have the opportunity to pen your own stories, poems, and essays. This outlet allows you to experiment with your imagination and discover your unique voice. You'll also be culturally aware Literature reflects the world around us. In your English class, you'll explore the different cultures, perspectives, and social issues. This exposure fosters empathy and broadens your understanding of the diverse society we live in. You will also learn collaboratively. You will engage in collaborative activities, such as group discussions, peer reviews, and literary projects. You will share insights and learn from your classmates' perspectives that will enrich your understanding and build valuable teamwork skills. As for technology, you, it will be integrated in every single skill that we learn. You have to embrace technology as a tool for learning. You'll utilize online resources, digital texts, and multimedia to enhance your understanding of literature and effectively present your ideas. You will grow as a reader. As you progress through your English classes, you'll notice your reading habits evolve. You'll become more comfortable tackling complex texts, and you'll develop strategies for comprehending and enjoying even the most challenging material. The primary books that are going to be used this year is My Perspectives. Uh, it is conducted in two volumes, volume number one, which is for semester one, and volume number two for semester two. So it uh, basically discusses English language arts from uh, either British literature, English literature, or American literature. And it, the total for these two books is six units. Three first semester, three second semester. So the first unit to be covered is Inside the Nightmare. The themes are mainly Gothic, the dark side of the human nature, the search for identity, desire versus duty, social alienation, the search for truth. As for the second units, outsiders and outcasts, the themes to be discovered, individuality, personal fulfillment, rigid gender roles, manhood and fathers, blackness and race relations, loneliness. As for unit number three, is extending freedom's reach, uh, again, the themes, freedom, captivity, life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness, loyalty, sacrifice, racial oppression, happiness, and sorrow. 
For unit number four, all that glitters, reality and illusion, ambition, greed and material possessions, sacrifice and suffering, happiness, love and attachment, tragedy and loss, God and spirituality. As for the last unit, blindness and sight, loss and human frailty, human limitations and possibilities, emotional negligence, fate versus free will. So, and there you have it, the exciting journey that awaits you in your high school English class, grade 10, from literary exploration to honing your communication skills. You will embark on a path of growth and discovery. You have to embrace the challenges and engage with enthusiasm and prepare to unlock your full potential. Remember, every word you read and write will contribute to your growth as a thinker, communicator, and lifelong learner, and a human being. Thank you so much.